Hello everybody, welcome back to American Truck Simulator once again. Something different today. We're going to be doing Texas Driver Simulator. Driving like an idiot on the highways of Texas. We're in Houston and we've got a Hellcat here. It's actually an amazing mod. And uh, we're going to go to El Paso. So across the entire state. Driving like an idiot. Listen to how amazing this car sounds when I fire it up. It's about to get the show on the road, so let's put this thing into drive. And we're driving the automatic, so we're not driving a stick shift today. A big thanks to Thrustmaster for sponsoring this video with the TGT2. I'm using a Sparco R3A3 rim here. That button box right there is by ATSAccessories.com. And Next Level Racing for the awesome rig I run, which is a GT Elite. So we're leaving the hotel here. We had a great time in Houston, but. Uh, you know, he's being careful right now. He doesn't want to screw his Hellcat up just yet. And this thing gets damaged very easy, just to let you know. And it rolls over very easy, too. I got the Motion Platform V3 on. All right, we're turning left up here. So here's the car from the outside view, if you want to see what it's like. And of course, we're going to go... Whoa, hello, dude. We're going to go around that guy. Because why not? How awesome is that, dude? Pretty good. And of course, as always, like later on, we'll uh, open our phone up and get on Twitter and stuff, you know, like we should. But we're going to try to get to El Paso as quick as we possibly can here. Now, the dash is saying things in kilometers an hour. I did not find a way to prevent that from happening. Oh my God, I'm going to get rocked in this thing today. My motion platform. But you can see the speed we're doing there on the speedometer, which it didn't feel like we we're doing 100 miles an hour in this car, but my God, I think we are. All right, we're making a left up here. Let's do this. There we go. Oh, okay. Okay. There's our first collision. Won't be the last one, I'll tell you that right now. But yeah, the interior modeled very nice. It's a really cool mod. Uh, I do like it a lot or exploring Texas, you know, and every time a new SCS state comes out, I like to explore it from like a car mod. And that's what we're doing today. I mean, we're going to, we're going to somewhat obey some traffic laws, but I mean, let's be real. Oh, you know what? Let's go get some McDonald's first. We have to get some McDonald's. Will they even let us in here? They might. Oh, hello. Did we hit something? We might've. This car bottoms out so easy. What do you guys want from McDonald's? Chicken nuggets and then uh, some fries. You know, they do that chicken nugget deal where it's like 40 nuggets and two medium fries and all that. We'll do that. Oh, here it is. It's already ready to go. Hey, what's going on? Okay, thanks. Perfect. Get the hell out of here. I mean, because the guy's a, you know, he's a doucher, but he doesn't want to crash his car, which I guarantee you we will crash this car. It's almost a guarantee. And we don't need to use blinkers. We're in Texas. That's not a thing, right? One hand getting on the highway. Oh my God. That thing is Bodie getting on the highway. There we go. <laughs> 65. They're already over a hundred miles an hour. And we're in Houston. So we're going to be out of Houston soon. Oh my God. Dude, the motion platform is just throwing me around in this thing. 120 miles an hour. Unless that's in kilometers and then the miles per hour is underneath there, which means we're about 120 now. Yeah, that would make more sense. Oh my God, dude. We are sailing right now. Right. Here you go. We'll do some uh, classic Texas driver stuff here. Now I've seen the videos online of how these drivers drive and it's, it's kind of like a cross between Florida and, and you know, every state has terrible drivers and this is no exception. But we'll be cutting in and out of traffic like that, you know, and screw it. We'll hit the, the shoulder here. Why not? Well, this thing is actually pretty smooth once it gets up to speed on the highway. Not bad at all. Keep left. There's an airplane over there. So how did your weekend go? You have a good one? We had a lot of fun. 
Oh, hello. Slow down here. Get around this this truck. Don't mind me, truck. I think it sounds better with the windows down. Yeah, we'll leave the windows down here on this one. You can hear the exhaust a lot better. Oh my god, I'm trying to like hang on for dear life. I was not expecting to roll this much on this car. There's some options on the car you can do. Um, you can make it into a police car, a Florida Highway Patrol police car, which is pretty cool. Oh, road construction? That means go faster, right? Reduce speed ahead. Yeah, right, dude. Oh my god, it doesn't want to turn! <laughs> oh, oh, he two-wheeled it! <laughs> oh my god, that was insane, dude. Did that just turn into an Estes truck like right out of the out of nowhere? I think it did. Hard in the brakes. <laughs> okay, so when I, lo I locked the brakes up, the whole thing went insane on me there. Okay, dude. We're gonna act like that didn't happen. I need to get on my phone. We need to this we need to do Texas style. Get on our phone, you know? Well, let me do that real fast. Let me open up Twitter or something here. I'm going to open up uh, YouTube Studio and read some of your guys' comments. That's always fun to do in these types of videos. Uh, Waffle House has found its new host. There it is. That's that meme, dude. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. All right, slow down. LaGrange, Austin, this way. Yep, that's what we want. Let's see how the cornering is on this thing. Not bad. Not too shabby. Uh, let's see. Oh, hello, going up the road, reading our texts. <laughs> oh my God, texting and driving in this is not easy, dude. Not easy. Oh my, it's, this thing is trying to kill me, this motion platform today. Oh my God. Uh, happy to see the series return. The series is what led me to channel three years ago. That's Fluffy McNutters Gaming, talking about LSPDFR there. Very cool. Some America, older America Truck Sim video comments. I read all the comments, by the way. I open up my studio and then it shows me all the comments. So I try to read as many as possible, even on older videos, if you're wondering. This is very difficult. All right. Uh, also, if a bad guy has uh, a gun on them, you're supposed to shoot them. And the bad guy was lucky. He did not shoot you. So keep up the good work. I was Schuyler. Thank you. Always leaves nice comments. Okay, around this way. He was referring to LSPDFR, which I've been having a blast with, by the way. Oh my God. Hold on. We're trying here. We're trying. Jeff, you do amazing content. Work alone with the boys and all the mods you feature. I love your ATS videos. I'm sure you exhausted to mention very time your setup. That was Dark Dav 300. Thanks, buddy. Oh my God. We're going to do it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. Oh my God. Jesus. <laughs> oh, come on. Roll over. Oh, good God. <laughs> Dead. Yep. We managed to shut the highway down. Look at that. We rolled it over. Cars are coming to a stop, except for the left lane. They're still going. No problem. We'll have to roll this thing over and continue our journey. All right. This time we're going to go ahead and uh, drive from the outside view. I'm going to open my uh, comments back up again, and we're going to continue down the road. It does have working blinkers, by the way. Not that we'd ever use them because we're in Texas, but you know. This guy is slamming the brakes. Turn our little mirrors on here so we can kind of see what we got going on here behind us. All right, cool. We'll continue. Oh, hello. Let's get our mic where we had it. I'm feeling the braking effects very heavy in the chair today. Oh, yeah. Um... I don't have a GPS. Oh, we're, we're fine on the GPS for right now. We're driving this. Okay, cool. All right, moving on. Yep, more Waffle House crap. I love the Waffle House, by the way. Don't get me wrong. I just don't know why that meme is taking off the way it does. Like many memes, it makes no sense. Uh, when you have free time, do a more lethal test than saying... Dude, talking about that LSPDFR uh, episode I did in there, uh, the, the lethal mod. Oh my God, Jesus. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. 
Okay. All right, we're back at it. No problem. Rolled it back over. No harm, no foul. But yeah, that lethal mod, everybody's going to want me to install that. So I think I'm going to have to do that for sure. So just caught, catching up on comments, you know, rolling down the road. Oh, that didn't sound good. Definitely damage to the car. Definitely damage to the car. There's a uh, airport ground handling simulator. There's a new sim by those guys that's coming out. I'll be covering soon enough when it releases, which is about being a flight attendant. Oh my God, dude, this thing wants to roll bad on me. Real bad. Yeah, you would know how to get so much money in ATS. Oh, modded profile, of course. Yeah, I've been looking for whatever's. All right, cool. All right. That's enough of the texting and driving uh, portion of this video. My, uh, I, I need to tighten my wheel down. I didn't realize how violent this drive was going to be, and I didn't uh, tighten it down. So let me do that real fast. All right, we should be good now. I think the car died on us there. Oh, hello. Let's get back on the road. Yeah, on these, uh, these wheels, you have a screw. You got to tighten when you swap out the, the wheels. That's what we got going on. All right. Oh, engine died again. That's not good. We're gonna have to get service on this thing as whenever we can. Come on. There we go. Now, now we're Texas driving right here, buddy. You better believe it. Have to wait for a gap to open so we can get around this guy. They're in a Porsche. Go faster. How is a cement truck passing us right now, dude? You gotta be kidding me. They get way up on his bumper. He doesn't know we're here enough yet. We have to wait till, there we go. Till that, uh, that license plate's missing. Here we go. Oh, he's merging into our lane. That was scary. That was just a little scary. Keep back 500 feet? I don't think so, dude. This is this is how you uh, you follow a fire truck, Texas style. Oh my, dude, they they're killing us here. Oh, there's the gap. You think we can make that gap? Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can. You better believe it. All right, we need to make it through the town without, we need to stop killing ourselves is what we gotta do. Drive like an idiot, but not kill ourselves at the same time. Ultima just slamming the brakes on us there. And now we're in traffic. That's okay. We gotta be so impatient, that we can't stand ourselves. I still have that window rolled up on the right. Oh, I did. Gillespie County right there. That's how you do it. Right there. Still no service station now. Yeah, getting back to the uh, the weekend. Hopefully you guys had a great one. I uh, We went to Top Golf on Friday. And uh, our friend is uh, going away for a few months. So we wanted to hang out. That's why I didn't have anything. Uh, no video on Friday, but I got uh, a lot of things squared away with 5M, so I'll be doing some OCRP content again. And before I get asked, yes, apps are going to be opening sooner than later, and uh, we're getting close, guys. We're getting close. I will let you know the moment it happens. I will make a dedicated video about it. I promise you that. Okay. She's cornering pretty decent here. It's, oh, understeered like a mother. And the, and the engine died on us. There we go. Goodbye Spring Creek. The open roads of Texas ahead of us here. Oh, it's gonna get dicey through here. Oh, we hit him. 
<laughs> oh my god dude the brakes are like non-existent and i even turned up the brake slider for this video oh we hit him didn't we yeah we did that's always good oh here you go right here all right after we fix our car we have to do a challenge where we drive like an idiot but we don't crash our car the rest of the way once we we fix it you know so risk versus reward no hezzy oh we hit that guy <laughs> Man, when you get stuck behind two trucks like this, it's rough. This is rough. You know what you do? This. You pull that maneuver right there. The lane existed for that little bit. Well, I'll tell you what, this game does not like how fast we're going across the ground trying to load all this stuff in. It's to be expected. Oh, is there a service station up here? Let's see. Let's see if there is. Yeah, there is here. We're gonna get off of this exit. Just like that. Yeah, we'll get off here and make a left. So we're in Junction, Texas already. Dude, we're making like quick time. It's kind of crazy actually. Okay. See, now we'll use our blinker so you can see what that sounds like. Yeah, that the engine's not doing well at all not well at all and it keeps dying on us come on you start there we go now, you, now that's like a hellcat driver right there rev it right here at the lights i wish you could do burnouts in this game but you can't sadly enough you cannot do that how are we on fuel uh we're fine on fuel is that a 389 behind us? Yeah, it is. You better believe it. I love the guy's face in the uh, river mirror. The driver. He looks ridiculous. Oh, that's amazing. Come, dude, how long is this light? <laughs> oh, we're driving like an absolute idiot. I wanted to get... You see what I'm talking about? This thing bottoms out like so quick. It's kind of crazy. It is kind of crazy. Turn left. What do we want? Oh, it's dying again on us. We got KFC. We got In-N-Out Burger. And we've got, uh, looks like Starbucks over there. That's our options. But we're going to go get service first. Yeah, this thing needs it bad. It's, we've only, you know, rolled it a few times. No biggie. All right. No cop, no stop. We're done waiting at that light. Oh, there's a Taco Bell. That's where we could go. Make up your mind and then we'll uh, swing by on the way out back to the highway. It's this garage up here on the right. Yep, this is it. This is the place right here to fix our car. And then I could show you uh, some of the options on the car. It's not a whole lot, honestly. So we did $1,341 of damage. That's always fun. And then I'll show you here on the configurator. Uh, you only have one option here, one option here, one option here, 707 horsepower engine. Uh, and then the eight speed transmission, which I've got uh, automatic. And then the interior, only one interior option, but it's a cool looking interior for sure. Color options, you can uh, have Florida Highway Patrol if you want, which is really cool. Uh, and the reason for that is because if you go over here, there's, you know, just all the other different colors, uh, you go over to here, you can uh, put a police beacon on there, although it's just uh, amber lights. It's not. And then that's pretty much it. Everything else is just stock, stock. Uh, I think you could, nope. Yeah, even that's stock. So there's not a whole lot you could do with that per se, but. That's okay. So in the interior, you can't change out the wheel. You can't change out the mirror or anything like that. You can't put any uh, accessories in the cabin, which would be really cool if you could do that. Uh, but that is the car. All right, some outside view action for you. I think we're gonna hit up the old Taco Bell. I think that's what we're gonna do. Taco Bell it up for you guys. Just kidding. Just kidding. Can we go to In-N-Out? Can we go somewhere else? Maybe KFC will let us out? Let's see if they'll let us in. Is KFC open? 
Or are they closed too? They're closed too. Okay, cool. We're just damaging our car like crazy over nothing here. Let's go across this way. And maybe we can hit up Starbucks, get a coffee. Although in and out Burger's up there. I don't think they're going to let anybody into any of those places. It doesn't look like. Yeah, we'll just pull up over here. Yep, coffee break. We'll hit up, hit up the Starbucks here. And then uh, we'll get ourselves a coffee. Okay, we got our coffee. We're going back out to our car. We need to see just how much further we got to go here. So looking at the map, we left Houston. We're in Junction now, and we got to go through Fort Stockton to Van Horn and then El Paso here. I wanted to pick up this little... Uh, little viewpoint there so we're gonna do that all right so let's not be such a jackass on this run so we don't tear our car up because you see how easy it is to tear this car up it takes no time at all yeah roll the windows down again gotta beat the traffic and we'll get back on the highway here i just don't want to hit that bus no cop, no stop. We gotta make this light anyway. All right, We're gonna hang on to our, uh, hold on to your butts. That's how fast you get up to speed. Pretty insane, man. Pretty insane. There's a whole rest area there. You gotta shoot the gap. Just like that. All right, let's try not to wreck this thing all the way to El Paso, but take as many risks as possible in the meantime. Stuck behind these trucks. Not gonna make that gap. Don't let your last uh, words be a text. That's what it said on that sign. Yeah, you can see texting and driving is so difficult, especially in this game with the motion platform going like crazy. Oh, he's getting off the highway. All right, let's go. See ya, Schneider. That was an airport there. A little Cessna that was holding short there of the runway. That was cool. Uh, 280 something miles to El Paso. surprised we haven't found a uh, Texas State Trooper yet because they would be pulling us over well they don't pull you over but they give you a ticket you know what I mean here you go now we're driving like a uh, like an idiot now we're driving like some of those compilations you see from Texas And I've seen plenty. What was it? The uh, it was in Houston uh, that that Hellcat ran from the police in that pursuit. I think it even outran the helicopter. I think it was a white Hellcat. So when I saw this car in Texas has been released, I was like, oh, we need to make one, man. We've got to do it. We got it. Hey, look at that, Prime. They're out of Springfield, Missouri. Shoot the gap. We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Oh, look at that. Now it's like no hezzy. No hezzy. Oh, hit the rumble strips a little bit there, no problem. Oh man, brakes, 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 brakes. See how squirrely the car gets under braking. If 
Covenant Transport. I need to do a uh, a run in Covenant. I saw there's a cool skin for that FLD. That'd be a lot of fun to do. Take that thing out for a trip. But what do you guys think of the uh, Texas DLC so far? Are you enjoying it? I've been driving it a lot on streams. Um, so I can say I like it a lot. And our prayers are going to be answered as SCS did talk about releasing in 2023 their new uh, engine. Or I think it's called Prism 3D is their gaming engine that they use for America Truck Sim that they made. So it's getting an upgrade for anti-aliasing, for performance, optimization, all that. And it's supposed to be out in 2023 sometime. So that's really cool. And it really needs it. Because even on like, you know, spaceship PCs, NASA PCs, it doesn't matter. The, uh, the car or the, uh, let me get around this guy first. The, um, performance just, it, it's just not very smooth with a bunch of mods and all of that. But some people say they have the same problem I do with the stutters, uh, and they're a vanilla game, so with a, with a nice PC, it just needs some love, man. That's all. Needs some love. All right, one hand this bad boy. That was bad. That was real bad. I'm pretty sure they just got absolutely destroyed. Hey, Fort Stockton, what's up? What's up, Fort Stockton? What's up? Big, big, huge gas station over there. Exercised. Well, truck stop. You know what I mean. Man, this, uh, when the chair starts whipping you around, it, it really does get difficult to hold onto the wheel. Hey, NASA. Houston, we have a problem. That was us earlier. Oh, we did it again. Damn. I thought we could make that gap. Now uh, we're getting sloppy with it now. One handed, man. It's, it's, it's a lot more difficult to drive this car one handed. I don't with the motion platform being absolutely crazy. It doesn't do that with the trucks. It's something to do with this car and uh, how jittery it is on the suspension. So I, I probably could have made the suspension stiffer. You know what? Let's try that. Let's stiffen up the suspension on the car what you can do in the the options for the game oh my god what do we even hit yeah the car bottomed out on nothing that was strange so truck stability trailer stability suspension stiffness is all right here so we're gonna bring it all the way up and all the way up and give that a shot all right let's see if this is any better starting position Oh yeah, I can already say it's easier to drive. I can already tell you that. Oh, that's amazing. There you go. We'll see how it corners up here on this one at speed. Oh dude, a lot better. Look how much smoother that is. That's what we should have done in the beginning, but it made for some wild moments. That's for certain. Oh, there's the understeer though. It chatters like that. Woo. But you can corner so well in it. Okay. Yeah, that is better. No biggie. All right. Got myself a screenshot there for a thumbnail. I'm be cutting off that suburban back there. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to cut the suburban off and then hit escape right at the moment so I can uh, get a picture. Right. Yeah, this thing is so much easier to drive now that we did that. So that's pretty cool. A lot more enjoyable. But if you want to get across the state quick, man, this is the way to do it in this game. Oh, we got pulled. There it was. That was a trooper I didn't even, is that a trooper right there I didn't even notice that is that really 
Let's see if it is the brakes here. Oh, it is Texas State Trooper. You can't tell from the back. It was like all blacked out, you know? Later, sucker. Oh my God, almost died. <laughs> there it is, got another ticket. <laughs> oh, that looks really good right there, that picture. That sight. Not bad at all. Oh, buddy. Oh, that got dicey. Just a little bit. We're in Van Horn. We're making a good time still. But even driving this fast and, and being crazy, you can just see how massive this state is in this game. So, if you're wondering, it takes a while to get across it. Oh my God, the stutters are so bad in this town. I don't know why. That's strange. <laughs> Whenever you tailgate AI, they slam the brakes on you. Oh, a Mustang driver. What's up, dude? Want to race? Let's see if they'll race us. Come on, you want to race, dude. Let's go. All right, full speed. Oh, Dustin and bro. Oh, I mean, he's not racing us, but you know. It's obnoxious. <laughs> so, Alaska Road, one mile. I'm still getting used to this state. I don't even recognize this area here. I might have driven it through the night, you know? I'm Warner Cable. See how vast Texas is. Look how far out you can see. I got right in our lane. Man, he hit the brakes hard. Oak Harbor Freights. We get in that lane, it's all over. We get stuck behind that dude. But we got this. We got this. No, we don't. No, we don't. This truck's going faster than that one. Horizon City in Socorro. This way. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Slow down. Y'all ready in Texas? Yeah, well. Hey, we made it to El Paso. All right. Well, nothing eventful happened. Um, I just uh, had to cut a bunch of this out because it... El Paso was stuttering so bad. And then turn like, it's just, it was unwatchable. Un it was unplayable for me, but unwatchable for you, so. We made it to the gas station we wanted to. Oh, look at this. Yeah, dude, it's it's done. Turn right. The game has given up the ghost. Maybe this car has a memory leak or something. I it, That's possible, too. I don't know. But yeah, it's, it's the worst I've ever seen the game stutter. So take it for what we will here. We made it to El Paso, Texas. That's all that matters. And let's kill the engine. There we go. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this episode of American Truck Simulator uh, doing Texas Driving Simulator today with the Hellcat. So let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. Sorry for all the skips and stutters, man. It's just... It's something. I got to figure out what it is, but uh, that's all right. We had a lot of fun. I'll see you guys next time. Take care.